we have had people that have to walk miles to school and still made it. Absolutely. Now we have buses taking our kids to school and they still won't go. They won't go. So we want to end that. We want to stop that. We want to make black history a reality. Because we want to make our history something that we, even though there have been bad times and we've looked at it bad times of slavery, it is something that has existed, whether we like it or not. So we don't want to take that slavery and look negative at it and do negative things. We want to do with slavery what the Jews have been with the Holy Cross. We can move forward and continue to move in a positive direction that will benefit all of us. And this is what this is about. This is about something that will encourage you and forbid you to go through life and educate your children, your family, your children. Every day we're learning more and more about what the African American meant to this country. Things that were hidden. We are going to unveil a lot of hidden things that people should know. And why should they know? Because we must protect our history. There were many things in our history that people didn't know that they told it was black. So as I always said, if we don't protect our history, then a lot of things won't be the same. The globe trial will end up white. <laughs> you know, Seriously. You know, All right. Serious business. So we must not just push it aside because there are some white people who show more interest than some of our own people. Because this is something that really basic. So we want to uh, acknowledge that Brother Ed Brown and Brother, uh, Brother, Brother Ed Brown and Dr. Uh, like Brother beside us, and Brother Dr. And that's going to be Brother and Brother Chris Allison will be in the other room to talk about the black church. Oh, would you stand, please? Brother Brown and Brother Justin, would you stand, please? Give him a hand.
give him a big hand. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to tell you just a moment. I've got to tell you this story. And, and he can confirm it because I tease him about it all the time. Derek Price is a brother who's so bad, he printed his own money. Now, I know you like, oh, you can't do that. Yes, you can. And Derek can do it. Yes, you can. And he now has a plan to not only revitalize the Maywood area, but every African American community in this country and on the African continent as well. Give that brother a hand. He's an absolute genius. And when you're in this class, ask him, did you print your own money? <laughs> See, I told you. That's what you got to be stinking bad. I'm sorry. 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 I'm Deal with that than Brother Vincent Smith. Brother Vincent Smith, now Brother Vincent Smith. Yes. We're going to go to the park there too. Uh -huh. And Ryan and Scott, Brother Vincent uh, back there. So, uh, and also I want to introduce my brother, uh, a cute friend, Walter Perkins. Hey, man.